Alright, third attempt making this video. Matt Hardy. Alright, before this video started, if you guys have not checked out my current state of the WWE video, please check it out. I've been getting good feedback from that video, so please go check it out if you can. Now, since this video, like I said, third time doing it. First time, I don't know what the hell I was talking about. I really was just like thinking things off the top of my head. Second time, 12 minutes long, don't want to be 12 minutes long, I want to be at least under 6 minutes long, and yeah, that was the third time, Matthew Hardy, <laughs> been a shitty week for you, huh Matt, shitty week, I mean shitty few days for you, huh Matt, this has probably been the worst week in Matt Hardy's life, first of all, the guy totals his car into a tree and gets arrested for a DWI, Number one. He also has a terrible mugshot. This is probably the te most, well, horrendous mugshot in history. Um, for entertainment, as in laughter-wise, it's probably the best mugshot in history. Maybe better than Marty Jannetty's. That's saying something. Alright, that's one. Second, he gets fired. He gets released from TNA. Third, what happened today? He's found unconscious, passed out, whatever you want to call it, in his house. And that all happened in a span of a few days. Now, something that something could happen to anybody in a span of a few months. But what happens to you in a few days, you know your life is fucked up. Now, Matt, I have a question for you. Why are you trying to be like your brother? Alright? Your name's not Jeff Hardy. It's not Jeffrey Hardy. It's Matt Hardy. Matthew Hardy. Alright? That's your name. Stick with it. Don't be someone you're not. If you're being someone who you're not, are you really you then? I mean, if you're trying to be like your brother, what's that make you? Jeff Hardy 2.0? God, let's not have one of those. Sorry about that. I was really interrupted by some pricks. <laughs> A.K.A. my parents. Anyways. What was I saying about Matt Hardy? Yes. Stop trying to be like your brother. Alright? Jeff, just because Jeff actually went somewhere in his career, unlike you, doesn't mean you gotta copy him. Oh, well, Jeff did this, so maybe if I do this, I'll go somewhere in my career. No. Alright? The Hardys, if you can describe the Hardys in two words, it would be... Crack addict, well, actually, that's two words. I make it three words. Crack addict and alcoholic. Three words I've described, the Hardy Boys. You know, but Jeff, he's actually realizing that all the shitty things that happened to Matt Hardy happened to him. So Jeff, I think, is trying to turn his life around, even though I'm not a huge Jeff Hardy fan. I know I was back in 09 when he was going after the world title, but that was just me, you know, just marking out because, well, I don't fucking know why I was marking out, but it was whatever. Jeff Hardy... I know there's a lot of Jeff Hardy fans out there, which I don't understand why he'd be a fan of his. But Jeff Hardy is whatever. Uh, like, I, I don't know if I mentioned it yet, but Matt Hardy's only my favorite Hardy of the two. Um, I always thought Matt Hardy had the look. You know, he had the look. He, You know, he used to be very muscular. Now he's just playing fat, eating his scrapes every day. You know, eating at the Waffle House. You know, just Matt Hardy, don't be like your brother. Don't follow the road he went down. You know, he went down a terrible road, you know, his house burned down, uh, he got freaking arrested for doing marijuana, I think he's still on trial, I'm not keeping up with that, so, if he is still on trial, it's comp low, if he's not, well, well, he should be considering he's not in jail right now, but, man, don't screw up your life, don't be like your brother, don't screw everything up, and then, you know, realize that, well, I could turn my life around, because Jeff Hardy is still pretty young, he's, he's he's early 30s right now, and Matt, you're late 30s, dude, you don't have much time to turn your life around, let alone your career, uh, turn around your career, what the fuck am I saying, I don't even know what I'm saying, uh, let me re-say that, Matt, you don't have m enough time to turn your career around, considering that you're almost done, uh, and to me, you're almost done. I mean, there's not much you can do. You know, there's rumors that he's trying to go back to WWE. It's not confirmed or anything. It's just rumors. Uh, personally, I'd be all for it because, you know, like I said, I'm Matt Hardy's one of my favorite Hardy of the two. And I don't know, I'll be 
I'd be all for him coming back, you know. I'm not gonna say, fuck you, don't come here. I'd be good with it if he came back. But I don't want to make this video any longer. Just comment below your thoughts on Matt Hardy and the whole situation he's had. Uh, all the links to the TMZ stories will be in the description below. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm Zach, and I'm flying out of here, guys. Thanks for watching. Later, skater.